previously on Control. Fable sensed a drowning man, a hunger in the dark. Investigation sector. Hello? Anyone here? Guess not. I feel this feels familiar. I'm. My name is Alan Wake. Endless darkness. Nothing holds still. The Federal Bureau of Control had stolen his life's work. This was his last chance, his final experiment. What he'd been too scared to do before. So, now I have to deal with an interdimensional noise and sentient shadows. The third thing, the sound made darker, the darkness made louder. Hartman was stretched like a worm through time. The third thing was a monster. Now we crashed out of darkness toward Phaeton. Recap over, cue transition. Okay, so it's really dark in here, as you can see. If you've played Alan Wake before, you know the, you know that being in the dark is not, is not a good idea. So I need a power core, and well, would you look at that? Go to hell! Wait, hold on a second. It sounds like this. It sounds like this. Nasty. Uh, okay. So there's a bunch of there's a bunch of stuff here. Eagle Limited summary. Okay, so there's a button, there's a lever there that I can't push. The shadow, uh, can I, okay. My understanding of the darkness is fragmented, incomplete. This abyss, this void, it very much does not wish to be understood. If light symbolizes knowledge, then it stands to reason that darkness would equate to ignorance. By its very nature, it abhors comprehension. Of course, my own nature drives me to comprehend all. We are opposing forces, destined to collide. And given this conflict of natures, we know that the light of truth will burn away the darkness, both figuratively and literally. Any significant light source can be used as protection, even weaponry, against this metaphysical gloom. And then there are the artists. I know for a fact that Tom, Wake, the Anderson brothers, and Lane all had some involvement with the darkness. The question is whether their uncanny ability to affect reality through their art beckons the darkness, or did their work perhaps even create it? With Wake now secure in my lodge, I expect I shall grow closer to learning the answers to these questions. Assuming he cooperates, which is proving quite the challenge. Well, perseverance is the foundation of knowledge. Speaking of, I must be off on my rounds. Hmm, interesting. Okay, so I don't know what this does, but uh, let's hope this does something nice. Holy shit! Wait, those are those guys flying with guns? Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, sure, throw grenades at me. Sure, sure. That's totally what you want, isn't it? Where the fuck did you go? Get over here. Son of a bitch. Okay, this, he's flying. He's flying. He's gonna get on my nerves real fast. Let's... Let's get out there. Son of a bitch, these guys are feisty. Yo, that's like I need my I need my gun to reload. Yeah, these guys are very annoying. Stop it! Stop! Don't play that yet, no. We should play. Oh, yep, clobbered him. Clobbered him good. Hey, you stop that. Yeah, come closer. I need you to be my friend. Oh, shit. Riveting gameplay. Okay, Mr. Flying Man, be my friend. Thank you. 
There's a bunch of other bad guys in here. I, I would very much like you to help me kill them. See, I knew I was gonna I, I knew I was gonna wreck this place sooner or later, and here we are. Thanks guys, you are a great help. Interrogation complaint. Okay, now I need to scour this place again for doc documents. Man, how are you flying though? Is it the hiss or something else? I don't know. Ooh, hey, a tape. Agent Fisher, day six inside the motel. Utilized surveillance methods are as follows. Fiber optic cameras slid under the individual room doors. Motion detectors in the lobby area. Tripwire, triggering a flash camera across the main entrance, even fingerprint powder on the front desk. Results are varying at best. But mostly just... Inconclusive and unusable. The footage is corrupted. Sometimes even the equipment is damaged. I don't know how, exactly. I, uh... I think this place is making fun of me. That's the only explanation. I, I can hear them laughing and screaming behind the closed doors. I can hear the call bell go and ding multiple times a day, but when I look, there's no one there. I know I'm supposed to stay out of sight, but I've seen the doors closing just before I can catch even a glimpse of anyone or anything. They're messing with me, whoever they are. I think... Wait, shh. There's something. I gotta get this. Gotta get the cable out. Come on, you fiber optic fuck. Cooperate. Okay, there we go. I guess that's the end of it, I think. <laughs> I didn't want to say anything because I thought it was like, it's gonna, gonna go on and on and on. Nice operation with you. Lots of documents I just have to catch up with. Uh, oh, these are bathrooms. Why is there, the hell? What's what's all this? Why is there delays caused by house shifts and not count towards overtime? I guess someone was working in here. Reminder, all employees are required to report their hours at the end of each month. The Federal Bureau of Control maintains that time is not subjective and hours passed on alternative planes cannot be claimed. Astral dives do not accumulate overtime compensation. Thank you for your attention. <laughs> uh, the poor people who go on dives into the astral plane do not get compensated for their work. Yeah, you probably wouldn't want to work for the Federal Bureau of Control anyway. You have to deal with crazy shit like this on an almost daily basis. Uh, one would occasion- one would- probably have to like yeah i mean like you would get exposed to dangerous situations like this like on the it, it sounds like pretty much on a daily basis are these lighten them up ah more plants <gasps> all right let's go make some more friends ati good to hear from you my friend i hope you're enjoying your vacation <laughs> Mold shit. It's not good for you. Headache, nausea, old man, depression. How can you tell when you are in it? This is a chaka as a error. Darkness everywhere. New day, same old bloody city. Except the old way. Like dark, but good for nothing. So I got three side quests, I guess. Uh, one is to, I guess, water the plants or talk to them because I remember there was a, I remember there was a side quest in the um, previous, in the in the main game where I had to run around and look, talk to plants. Uh, I want to oh, yes. power course uh, consume, taken. So I guess I I should have, <coughs> I should have used it on that one instead of the one in the center room oh well i don't know i uh i suppose i'll find another power core sooner or later but uh let's see if there's a checkpoint this, this well the, check, the control points are pretty frequent nowadays in, the, in this particular expansion pretty cool oh okay 
Maybe I should bring a lamp in here. I like how she was covering her face and mouth like it was some sort of deadly gas. Hold on a second, let me grab the lamp. I need you, good sir. I'll, I'll tackle the side quests for like when I'm like off camera, but for now... Uh, I don't feel right. Something in this darkness is draining me. Yeah, first of all, I actually want to go back to the door and take a picture of this, just like the scene. All right, Mr. Lamp, you're coming with me. Yeah, something in here is fucky, Jesse. Something in here is real fucky. Ooh, arcade machines. I guess this was a break. Oh, it's draining the, um, it's draining her psychic energy thingamabobber. Shit, that's not good. That is not what I meant to do either. Hartman background. Okay, so I need... Ah, yeah, it's, it's Alan Wake mechanics all over again. Staying in the light gives me gives me my power back. Okay, so there's a bunch of storage shelves over there. Uh, a couple of power core sockets all over the place. I think I need to figure out uh, where to get more power. Where to get more power cores, I guess, because um, I can't see anything. Screw it. I'm just gonna. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna quickly. I'm just gonna go here and I don't know. Go down, I guess. Creepy. That is. Re oh my god, it just disappeared into the smoke. Wait. Like. Ah. You have one of those. So I can't actually touch it. Okay, uh. You stay right there. I'm just gonna grab a couple of these power cores from this storage space. Uh, and also pick up all of the sh- I'll, I'll pick- uh, pick up all of the- Vending machine procedures, um... This is creepy! Ooh, a tape. I'll listen to that later, but, um... Other things come first. Okay. Do? Popcorn, come here! Go over there for me. Thank you! Uh... It's around here. So, there it is. Yeah, I can't actually shoot it, which is, which is bad. There's another power core over there just, in case I, just so I can grab it. Okay, so yeah, there's a bunch more stuff in here that I can get, but I'm choosing not to until I've defeated the creature. Uh. Oh, so this is just a staircase that goes up. Mod probably. Okay, give me. Yeah. Over there. Okay. Come on. Boop. And then we turn on the lights to the whole room. Bitch. Go away. Okay, now we get to explore. Awesome. Whew. That was a thing, isn't it? <laughs> if only Term were here to see what that thing was. It's like the thing that had been, that had been... Arcade machines. Shoom. Shim. Shoom. Whatever. You're a nerd. What is this dude? Play Shoom. Crowd control or deadline. Uh, let's... No, no, let's try car control. That's pretty cool. It's fire against the horde of his. Oh, these are the side. Oh, these are the. This is the arcade. The the actual arcade machine boss fight thingy that the uh, the um, the expansion had. Okay, I get. I get. Oh, that's a big 
go blow up your friends. Blow up your friends. Blow up your friends. Uh, 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 uh. Ow! Son of a bitch. I remember this place. This is the security sector, I think. With all the with the big map, there used to be a control point here, and I guess there isn't now. Am I supposed to be waiting for new enemies to spawn or no? Oh wait, hold on, this is not Stop that. Stop shooting rockets at me. Come here, you. I could use your help. Hey, whoever that is, that is that's shooting rockets at me, stop it. Okay, you. I need you on my side. You two. Thank you. All right, you two. Go. I will. I will most definitely need your help. But hey, why not you two? Thank you. I accidentally mangled the guy that it was working. Oh, I got that work for me. Oh god, more exploding points. Go away, go away, go away. Well, this is awkward. Now, there's an enemy. I think there's still enemies around. Ah! Stop it! You know, if I could mind control you, that'd be really great. Big guy, big guy, big guy, not good, not good, not good, big guy. Have a seat! Or part of a seat. Oh hey, I can, I can actually mind control you. Come here! Mom, like, is this is the DLC. Yes, this is the DLC, child. Welcome to the stream, my guy. Nice to have you around. Also, there's a Healy boy over there that I need to make mine. Here we go. Ow. Stop it. Oi, get back here. Okay, Mr. Healy Boy, you are mine now, clown. Yay, constant health regeneration. That's always a plus. Oops. Damn, you don't mess around with the minigun. Here we go, big guy. Shit. Oh, I think the big guy's dead. Oh, no, 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 he's not. He's kept alive by the... He's kept alive by the big spear. That's pretty fine and dandy, actually. Oops, sorry! Ow! No, catch the rockets, Jesse! Not the, not the debris, thank you! And how are you doing today, Shells? Nice to have you on the stream. I think I saw you streaming earlier, I think. Hey, hey, Rocket Man, stop it. Thank you. See you. Well, 
my my healy boy has died, so. else? Anyone else? Any more? This is really fun, but I really just want to get- oh, I can't, I can't actually exit this. I think I might have to die. Oh, I hear, I hear grenade launchers. Launch a grenade at me. Is that what I'm gonna do? Here, have one. Have that back. Uh oh. Nope. Work for me, buddy. Yeah, you were. Yeah, I saw you were on. I knew I was. I knew my eyes weren't deceiving me. Yeah, give it to him. Do him dirty. Stop it! That is not funny. I didn't laugh. Ooh! Ooh! Wait, is that a minigun, dude? No, oh my god, it is. I have one of those. One of these. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> really got bad, really got bad! Okay, wait, hold on. Ah! Minigun good, minigun good! Hey, there we go. Got even more now. Oh no, it's not those invisible fishes. Shit. I need you to work for me, pal. There's an invisible boy in this room somewhere, and uh, need it, it needs to die. Ah! Stop it! Thank you. Oh, 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 healy boy, healy boy, healy boy, healy boy, my, 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 my. Come back here, you dweeb. Come back here. Oh my god. Just bar the death just barely missed my head. Hold on a second. Yep, 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 yep. Where is the Where is the Healy boy? Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Come back here, you dweeb. Ow! You know, if you worked for me just a while ago, I could have had all my boys be good and safe and sound, but no, you just had to... Oops. MC! Stop it! Come here, you. Man, say hi to your friend for me. Oh my god, stop! Hey, you know what? Yeah, you work for me now. Thank you! Yeah, work for me! Uh oh. In. Ow! Asshole! Work for me! Oh! Shit! Big dude! I could use you on my side, you know.
Here, you're mine. Thank you. Oh my god, there's another Healy boy around here somewhere. Oh, yep, there it is. And it, this is their Healy boy, not ours. I want you to be mine. Or at the very least, die. There you go. Oh, yeah, at the very least, just die so that the, the other guys don't get killed. You know what I mean? Stop that! Stop it! Oh my god, there's another one. Snap! Well, uh, this is awkward. Let me have one of these. Hey, come back here. I want you to work for me, Mr. Ball. Thank you. Now my people can stop dying. Oh, uh... uh. Oh my god, I wasn't actually trying to actively kill it. Oh well, I do. Hey, 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 To work for me, thank you. Jeez, Louise. You're <laughs> oh my god, not you again. Why don't you die? Okay, uh. He's the guy to be the guy, why not? You have one of these. Work for me, bro! Just relaxing. Nice to hear. Good to hear, Chelt. Hope you stream it well as well today. Oh shit, it's a big dude. Yes, Mr. TK guy, go! Well, sh Yes, now you work for me! Half the other enemies are there as well, right? Yep, you work for me as well, sir. You had a shield, so... I assume you are a member of... You are of some importance. I just gotta let my focus recharge. There's a dude. There's a dude Reno around here somewhere. Yay! Yeah. Oh, they're all done. That was pretty cool, wasn't it? Shoo. That was pretty cool. Although that did take up quite a bit of time. I'm gonna have to. All right, time to explore. Uh, okay, so there was this area here that I haven't gone to yet. I think there was a document here. Uh, a bunch of offices, nothing special. I think there's a, yeah, there's a document in here. Thank you. Ice Springs screenplay, page one. 
There was uh, there's a document in here. I picked it up on the floor. There's a tape up here too. So let's listen to this. Okay, this room is really intimidating and all, but I know my rights. It's not a crime to try and get a book signed. Making unauthorized contact with a dangerous paranatural entity is indeed a bureau offense, Mr. Langston, and can be prosecuted as such. Uh, okay. Well, I didn't know that. Listen, this is being blown way out of proportion. All that happened is I heard Dr. Hartman had been brought in, and since I'm a huge Alan Wake fan, I thought it'd be cool to get a copy of The Creator's Dilemma signed. Uh, that's a book that Hartman wrote about... We know what it is. Okay. Uh, good. So, yeah, I was just looking to fill out my weight collection. I certainly didn't know Hartman had turned into some kind of shadow zombie. That's a completely inaccurate description. Whatever. Listen, I'm just a desk jockey. I sort papers, do data entry, that kind of stuff. Don't come down on me like this. I made one mistake. I mean, I see people break the rules all the time, and no one is pulling them into dark rooms to yell at them. Yesterday, Dave Gleason and his crew were talking to that empty spacesuit and laughing their heads off. We're letting you off with a warning, Mr. Langston. But this is going on your record, so one more screw up and our next chat won't be so friendly. Great. That is just great to hear, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey, is there any chance I could get my copy of The Creator's Dilemma back? Get out. Langston, you're a nerd. Uh, that, that interrogator voice sounds very familiar, and if you've ever played Ghost Recon Breakpoint or uh, Ghost Recon Wildlands before, you would probably recognize that as the voice of Bowman, Karen Bowman, the, uh, the CIA handler in that particular game. Get me up there, I want to get that document, son of a... Stop it, okay, thank you, fucking flying powers, I swear to God. Can I get this book, please? <laughs> Door appearance, and I guess this is, it looks like another tape. Brian Hennerman, 21 years old, resident of Southern Texas. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I really don't understand why I'm here. You know what you did, Mr. Hennerman. I do? Tell me about Delivery Disaster. The movie? I don't... I mean, it wasn't very good. That's not what your review said, but we'll come back to that. Tell me where you got the movie from. Movie night, with a, you know, okay, not an end, not, not night, like nighttime, but... Who contacted you? Who told you to review that film? No one. I just did it because it looked obscure. I didn't even like the movie. I should have given such a high score, but reviewing obscure films makes them smart. And I thought if I look smart, I would get listeners. My podcast would take off and I could go down to my parents' basement. I may even go to college and get a film degree like I've always wanted to. I swear. I swear, I swear, I swear. <sighs> okay, the kid doesn't know shit. I'm ending the session. <laughs> is the stream working? I think it's working, isn't it? I'm very... Yeah, it is working. Okay, good. I just have to make sure sometimes because it likes to play. Sometimes um, slobs likes to play with me like that. Uh, okay, so those were that was there. Um, I have been here before, and I've already taken all the documents from here. Uh, I've done that. That's the arcade machine. Uh, there's bathrooms, I think, but there's nothing in there. There's the staircases. Okay, so I have looted this place clean of any sort of documentation. Uh, now it's time to take some pictures.